it's been a hell of a long time since I last did video. I did try to do a video last week or the week before but the Sega Saturn was playing up so I, I couldn't do that. And I haven't really had any pickups to talk of as of kind of mainly uh, mostly this year. I've not really had any pickups at all. Um, I do have, I did pick up something. I picked up The Fight, which was a PS3 game, one of those move games that I didn't even know existed, and it was like two quid. And I stumbled across a video of it when I was looking, for it, looking at some PSVR stuff, and it's it's got Danny Trejo in there, and he's fucking street fighting and fucking bad man stings in it so yeah um, that's pretty much my pick up of the year and then I just decided to go a bit stupid and buy something that I didn't want but I knew was going to be inevitable it's actually something that I had a pre-order for could have had it day one um, I've been waiting for the price to drop company who makes this thing never drops prices because they are complete fucking assholes. Um, I'm not happy with stuff I've bought from them in the past um, but this thing is really popular I don't really understand why um, and I, I don't know why I bought it to be honest but um, you may be able to guess what it is probably not it is a <laughs> one of them fucking things Nintendo Switch yeah not proud of myself um, I did pick up Zelda Breath of the Wild um, I got these from uh, Curry's kind of reserved it and then went down and picked them up uh, 289 for the Switch and the game this game uh, I I've kind of been deliberating over getting it for the Wii U and I don't like the price it goes for um, so yeah to get this for like a tenner over the kind of price of just the console by itself I thought it was a fair deal so uh, yeah I went down to Curry's and picked up a Nintendo Switch because I'm fucking stupid I aim one one um, and also, I should mention that I purchased um, FIFA 19, the Switch version. Don't be in the comments telling me it's inferior, should have got a PS4, Xbox One. I know this, um, but I just got the Switch and it was 18 quid digitally. I was going to get a physical copy of it, but the thing is with FIFA, the physical copies end up worthless anyway. So, get it digitally and then somewhat somewhere down the line if I want to I can hopefully pick up a physical copy of it for like a quid um, yeah so a Nintendo Switch Zelda and FIFA 19 so uh, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to switch to my phone and uh, I'm going to show you some ins and outs I guess I'm just going to show you what's in the box if you've never fucking seen one I mean everyone's allegedly got one of these fucking things I don't really understand why because when I start looking at games I want I want to buy for this thing there's pretty much nothing <laughs> to be honest a load of rehashed fucking shitty games like I don't want to play Saint, well I do want to play Saints Row the Third I've actually been playing it again on uh, Xbox One but I don't want to play it on an inferior console that's worse than the Xbox 360 version. I don't want to play. Well, I do, I do want to kind of want to play Alain Noir on this actually, because um, I stopped playing through that again on PC and. Uh, then, but yeah, I'm waffling now. Uh, yeah, there's not really anything I want to play on this thing. Bad purchase decision. So by now you're probably cursing and abusing me in the comments section. This fucking guy doesn't know what the fuck he's on about. Um, but hold fire because there are a few um, positives. I actually, um, so far there's some things I like about this thing. Um, I, I, I like some things about it. I just don't see what the fuss is about. I think it's overhyped um, as with anything Nintendo to be honest. Um, I think kind of the thing is that the hype comes from America and Americans absolutely fucking skeeting all over this shit. Um, we 
didn't have the NES really well we did in the UK but it wasn't very popular um, so we don't have any nostalgia or any brand of, well m the majority anyway don't really have any affinity um, to Nintendo the way, I, I, the way I look at their consoles is NES nobody had it Super Nintendo yeah it was kind of more of a um, the less it wasn't as cool as the Mega Drive the Mega Drive had loads of cool and violent games and stuff so it was a bit it was a good system but it's yeah it's arguably a better system than the Mega Drive but uh, more people had Mega Drives than what, uh, where I live anyway because everybody's poor anyway um then you had what the n64 which looking back was absolutely atrocious compared to the ps1 and has hardly any good games on it and then you had the gamecube which was utter dog shit the wii everybody had one it was dog shit it was basically a gamecube with wafty things and uh did they have anything yeah the absolutely fucking dire shit bollicle Wii U, so yeah, um, nin fuck Nintendo basically. Well, right, anyway. This is the box and there's no fucking switch in it. Where's my fucking damn fucking switch? Oh, we just left like the useless gubbins that nobody actually uses. These fucking wrist straps for autistic fucking retards. So anyway, fuck that shit over there. This is the main event, this is Nintendo Switch, oh my god, in its dark with fucking HDMI and power and tings in it. Right, so if I slip this out of its dock, um, we have the, uh, I was going to say Wii U then, we have the Switch and uh, it has a kickstand on it, apparently I've never actually tried using it. Ooh, showing a bit of sexy leg. Um, that's the kickstand, is it? And that does something. Try and do whatever. I'll, I'll probably break that, so I won't touch it. Uh, we have USB-C on the bottom. USB-C, is it usb -C? Yeah, USB Type-C. Um, we have the bit where the game goes in there. Um, we we have kind of the, the heat pipe and vent arrangement there. You can see the copper heat part there. Um, that looks kind of cheapo, nasty, to be honest. You can feel a little bit of heat coming out of there when you're playing the games and things. Um, volume button, power button. Um, and obviously you've got the bits on the sides where your Joy-Cons slot in, which I won't do on camera because um, that's going to fail epically. Try and do it one-handed. Um, so, yeah, this is the dock. Um not the weightiest feeling thing a little bit cheap feeling to be honest um to be honest the whole thing it i wouldn't say it feels cheap but it doesn't feel like you know iphone premium or anything um so the ac adapter goes in there we've got a usb there um hdm out so the usb uh, i'm not sure whether you can use memory sticks with this and things I have ordered one of those 8-bit dough um, wireless receiver things, USB, um, because, where well, was where's, where's my fucking Joy-Cons? Joy-Cons come with this um, thing here. Um, the Joy-Cons kind of detach. I said I wasn't going to do this, but I'm going to try. One-handed Joy-Con operation. There we go. Um, yeah, basically these slide into this thing and there isn't a battery on it. You'll, you'll know all this because it's a fucking switch and everybody's got one. So anyway, um, yeah, I ordered the 8-bit dough wireless adapter thing so you can, um, in theory, I mean, I don't know how well it works yet, you can use a PS4 and Xbox One controller and all that shit and the 8-bit dough controllers, which I don't have so I won't be using. Anyway, uh, yeah. That is the controller. To be honest, I thought this was going to be absolutely horrendous, but you uh, quickly get used to it. And to be honest, I find it more comfortable to play with this on the um, TV than I do with it on the sides of the actual Switch. Um, I believe, to be honest, that one would assume, yeah, you can, because um, you can detach them, you can, if I can find the fucking thing, you can... Um, Press the home button to attach, sync, whatever. Or maybe you can't do this. 
I assumed, yeah, there we go. There we go, yeah. So we can use it as like a little mini TV with a kickstand and all that shit and all of that kind of stuff. You get me. Um, one thing I will do is I'll take this game out of here. And I'll just switch to the other camera. And the reason I've switched to the other camera is because... <laughs> Mm, it's supposed to have some chemicals and shit on it, in it. So, stop you eating it. That does not taste. I don't. I don't want to lick the the paper label bit, but that does not taste bad enough for me to like. Not eat it. Well, instantly, anyway. You, maybe if you gobbled the whole thing, it'd taste like shit. Um, but, yeah, uh, it's overhyped when people are doing that. Oh, it's, it's, fucking dickheads. You know what I mean? Dickheads, all of them. So, yeah, that is the Nintendo Switch. What I bought, I got the grey one because I'm not a five-year-old and I got OCD and I don't like having different colours on different sides. I imagine that would be pretty fucking distracting. Um, and it looks shit if you get the neon one, as they call it. Things I do like about this um, system. I know that the PS4 has like the rest mode, where you can put it in rest mode. Um, but the, the switch, when you put it in sleep mode or whatever, is like instant on and instant off. And you can kind of... Um, the first thing I ever used with that kind of functionality was the original iPad, where you just go... You know, and you you're back in the game instantly. Um, so yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, I played a little bit of um, FIFA 19 in the um, in handheld mode. I didn't like it to be honest. I I don't know. The, the, I don't like the screen. I don't like the massive fucking bezels on it. Um, and the reason I have bought this is because um, I'll be taking it on holiday when I go on holiday. Um, and I will probably take the dock with me because um, I mean it's it's quite, it's quite light so you can take the dock with you as well as you know playing with the actual switch on the plane on the way to the holiday destination and all that stuff but so yeah I picked up a fucking switch because I am stupid and there's not really any games that I want to play because I think Mario games are overrated I need Sonic games Give me Sonic, I know there's like two, three, there's at least three Sonic games on the Switch, but uh, eat my fucking Nintendo Wii U, because it's fucking shit, bye.